I hope you all are having a fantastic Sunday today. I just got back from watching Sonic the Hedgehog with my daughter, and it was a fantastic experience. I really enjoyed this movie a lot. It's thoroughly enjoyable, and my daughter absolutely loved the movie as well. Um, it's one of those films that I think can be enjoyed by pretty much all ages. Um, there really isn't any sort of specific age for this movie, and I really appreciated that about it. I think everyone can find the, the charm and appeal of this movie appealing, uh, no matter what age you are. So, uh, that's what I really liked about this movie as well. Jim Carrey was fantastic in this movie. He was so good. He reminded me so much of, like... I don't know, a nine, like the, the 90s Jim Carrey, uh, the, the early 2000s Jim Carrey. He really had that vibe going for him, and it really, really worked in this movie. He did fantastic, and I can't wait to, uh, to see what happens with him in this Sonic universe moving forward. Um, it was great. Um, I, I love the fact that they kind of teased some expansions on this universe as well. It was really, really fun to see how they did that. I'm not going to really get into any of that. I'll let you guys go see the movie for yourself and uh, check it out. But I really do recommend this movie. If you haven't seen Sonic yet, it's, it's, it's a great time. It's great with kids. The kids loved it. All the kids that were in the theater when I was there, uh, they, they all had a fantastic time watching it. You could just feel the excitement in the room from all of the kids as they were watching the movie. So that was really cool to, to uh, see as well. And of course, the greatest thing about this movie is the redesign of Sonic. And that will always go down as one of the big moments in movie history where Sonic came out. He was a horrible design, absolutely nightmarish, and uh, the fans hated it. <laughs> Everyone was like, please, oh my gosh, please change this. And um, and actually, people weren't really even asking for a change necessarily. They were just talking about how trash it looked. And it did look really bad. And then the director, Jeff Fowler, he was like, you know what? We are going to do the unthinkable. We are going to redesign Sonic from the ground up. And that's what they did. And it worked. And they pulled it off. Sonic looks amazing in the movie. He looks so good. And um, that that is incredible. The fact that a, a director and a studio, a, the studio uh, obviously had to green light as well, Paramount Pictures, and they did. Um, but they uh, they did the unthinkable. They went back, they redesigned, so redesigned Sonic, and because of that, this movie is garnering so much more attention and respect from the fans and appreciation because the filmmakers decided to respect the fans and deliver what the fans wanted they respected the fans and jeff fowler is a is awesome he's great and i i have a lot of respect for him now i can't wait to see what he does next and i really hope he does a sequel to, to sonic because that would be fantastic um so, you know, that is amazing. That is absolutely amazing. And just on that alone, I feel like that as fans, if we really want to see Hollywood change their ways and go back to a point where they respect the fans and they want to give fans what we want, you know, they, they aren't just worried about their political agendas. They're more worried about trying to do stuff that will make the fans excited then I suggest going to support this movie because that's exactly what this movie stands for. It stands for all of that. And the more support that this movie gets, the more people will be able to look at that from Hollywood and see that if they actually respect the fans and listen to the fans, then they'll get a lot more support from people like, like me. Like, honestly... I, was, I wasn't really even expecting this film to be that great as just like a film in, its, in general and stuff. Like I, even after they redes redesigned Sonic, I was like, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'll go check it out and support them just on that merit alone that they, you know, listened to the fans and they respected the fans. But I still don't really think this movie is going to be that great. And I was wrong. This movie is really enjoyable. It really is. It, it's a fun movie. Um, it's, it's pretty simple as a movie, but... Jim Carrey is amazing. He is absolutely just the, the, uh, he, he steals a lot of the attention in the movie and he does it very well. Um, but even some of the other things about this movie, I really appreciate as well. Like there's a really, really strong, positive, uh, family message in the movie, um, as well, which was great to see. It's always great when they put actual positive family, uh, messages in movies and they definitely did that with this. And, um, 
I appreciated the fact that the cop in the movie, the the police officer, he wasn't he wasn't like a, a a soy boy bimbo or anything. Like he actually was a pretty cool guy. Like they actually made him a pretty masculine dude, and I was like, wow, that's that's pretty cool. Wasn't expecting that. But uh, so anyway, I, I really enjoyed this movie and I highly, I highly recommend it. And please go check it out if you get a chance. That would be great. And uh, bring some kid, bring your kids with you. Don't just bring any, <laughs> bring some kids, bring your kids with you if you want to as well. <laughs> so with that being said, let me know in the comments below if you've seen Sonic, what you think about the movie. Uh, I would love to hear what your guys' thoughts are in the comments. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you all very soon in another video. Talk to you later. Bye. With my heart's desire